And by the title of the video, you can see I'm unboxing a Bose SoundDock Portable. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So this dock retails for $399 if you pick it up any time of the year other than Christmas. But if you get it on Christmas, they have it for $349 at Bose.com and on Bose's website. So uh, the reason I got this dock is... One is Christmas, and two, I wanted a dock with has better sound quality versus an iHome that I used to use. So here is a Bose Sound Dock, our commitment to you letter, if you guys uh, want to read it. I'm not going to go through it, of course. Set that to the side. Inside, we also have a better sound through Bose envelope. And inside of this, we have its instruction manuals in the English and... Swedish and uh, for your records and register your product which every company wants you to do register your product with them so let's set this to the side too uh, top we have the Bose looks like a sound charging brick for it let's open it up take a look whoops and uh, seems like they have a adapter plug that I'm supposed to plug in uh, this is the brick of the uh, sound dock. It's not pretty, not very big, and it seems to copy Apple's design of winding it around itself. Set that off to the side. Uh, we also have the Bose remote, which comes in gray here, as shown. It's in plastic, which I'm not going to open because it's going to be a little bit difficult. And we also have the little plug here which I'm assuming plugs into that and uh, you can change it by region here I'm assuming because it's a uh, you can take it off from the power brick and underneath the cardboard itself uh, that's it on the top it's just eggshell carton and underneath it in big fancy plastic we have uh, the Bose sound up there's nothing else in the box guys so. but underneath it we have the Bose sound up portable itself in all its holy styrofoam lightness. Let's open this up here. Oh god, this is nice. Uh, so right off the back, comes in nice styrofoam. And here you go, this is the Bose Sound Dot Portable. Really sleek looking and by the looks of it, there seems to be no buttons. Uh, this dock here falls in and out. I was at Bose when I picked this up and a uh, really cool feature that this uh, swivels in and out so for during transport you can't break the dock by accident. Here's the side of the dock and on the back of the dock you have an audio in cable and the charging port for the dock itself and of course in the back of it you have a lithium ion battery with Bose's name on it. On the well, it depends. Right hand side of the dock, you have two touch sensitive buttons, which you guys can't see, but they are touch sensitive. There's two touch sensitive buttons over there. And that's it, that's on the dock. It's uh, really, you're using the remote of the uh, dock to really control it at this point, because there really isn't anything on the dock that uh, you can use to control this with besides the remote. Thank goodness I checked out Bose website. This remote retails for about 10 bucks, so you can replace it real easily. And uh, according to them, it's pretty durable of a remote. So, uh, um, the dock weighs 5.23 pounds or 2.37 kilograms, which is pretty heavy for a dock at 5 pounds. But um, the look is sleek, and when you combine it with the uh, clean looking brick and its uh, interchangeable plugs, it does make it a pretty uh, well built dock. The weight of it is nice. It really does feel like it's not going anywhere, and it has a, like, a aluminum mesh on the front of the dock, and the sound quality from this dock is pretty far superior. So uh, I'm really excited to check it out and uh, try it with my iPhone 4 and my iPod Nano and see how this thing stands up to an iHome or anything like that in that mix. But um, if not. I have a review of this dock coming out uh, in three days to a week from now, and uh, three days to a week is a pretty big gap. But I will review this dock and I will give you my full personal thoughts on it. I really am liking the design, and uh, it does only come in one color. So if you're people who are like, I don't like the silver, I don't like the black, I'm really sorry, guys. But this is the only color Bose makes a dock in, which is kind of disappointing. 
But um, if you guys head over to Bose.com, they have some new docks there, which uh, don't have the dock. They work on Bluetooth, so you guys can check those out. But I picked this one up just because, according to them, it also charges your iPhone or iPod Nano or any iPod when you plug it in, which would be great for a nightstand uh, for my phone. Instead of just getting an Apple dock, I got the Bose Sound dock. So this dot retails for $399, estimated retail price, but if you pick it up during the holiday, it's $349 from Bose. And I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing of the Bose Sound Dot Portable.